This might be one of the most advanced, yet simple, and straight up useful pieces of tech I've used in a long time. Right, so in this day and age, with all this wonderful technology around us, most people nowadays want that added layer of home protection. Whether that's to remotely keep an eye on your property when you're away at work or on holiday, or to receive notifications sent straight to your phone to tell you that a shady character has been seen snooping on your land, or whether it's just to simply chat to the postman to let them know to leave a parcel in a safe space. Well, this here Swan All Secure 652K Wireless does all all of the above and more because crucially this has a very rare and quite unique proposition in this area of smart home security that I really wanted to test out. Disclaimer, this video is sponsored by Swan, but as well as showcasing all of the features and telling you the things that I really like, I'll also go over some of the things that I think potentially could be improved because they may be deal breakers for you. So usually with home security, you have either a wireless Wi-Fi system where all of the footage, etc., gets stored on a cloud style subscription service, or you have a hardwired system where all of the footage gets sent to a kind of in property hub and saves to a kind of hard drive. The advantage of wireless is the ease of setup and the lack of need to sort out all the physical hardware for storage. It just goes straight to the cloud and can be easily accessed. The downsides of these kind of systems are number one, battery life of the cameras, and number two, cloud storage subscriptions can be fairly costly over time. The advantages of wired systems are usually reliability of connection and 24 seven surveillance with no downtime because you don't have to worry about battery. But aesthetically, with all the cables, they sometimes can look quite ungainly and they are usually far more difficult to install for the every person and that may in turn produce some extra costs if you're getting someone in to install them. But the Swan All Secure 650 kind of fuses the two because bar one thing, which we'll touch on, it has all the ease of installation of wireless, so the cameras can be placed anywhere, and if you want to run them off your Wi-Fi, you can, but it also has a hub too, which is connected to your router and can be used with an ethernet cable and has one terabyte of inbuilt storage. And that's the equivalent of about two years of recorded clips before it needs to start rewriting. So you're not tied down to a cloud subscription, but you can still get easy access to your footage. Inside the retail box, you get stickers to warn potential assailants to scare them away. And also in some countries and regions, you have to by law inform anyone who may be near your property that you are indeed potentially recording them. You also have cameras and batteries for said cameras, cables and mounts. And in the second box, you also have more stickers, paperwork, including a welcome guide and how to set up the system and install the app. More on that in a second. And you also get ethernet, HDMI and power cables. You also have another battery in there as well as a mouse, which isn't the most premium feeling, I must admit. Definitely could get an upgrade there, uh, but it does have one key important function during setup with one potential slight negative and you have the hub. And this is the central nervous system. This is the brain. On the back, you have a slot for a rechargeable battery. And next to it, you have an HDMI port, which allows you to plug the hub straight into a TV or monitor. And you have a LAN port, two USB type A's, a micro SD card slot for additional storage and your power. And each battery has its own type C charging port too. When the batteries are inside the hub, they are automatically charging. And this brings forward one of the first key features that I think is ingenious because you always have a spare battery ready to swap out and in as soon as one of the other cameras begins to get low in battery. So you have next to no downtime at all for a wireless camera system. This is brilliant. And get this, each battery can last in a camera for up to four months, which again, for a rechargeable battery camera system, I've not seen anything like this. Also, because that battery is automatically charging within the hub, if you do have any problems with mains power, you have a power cut, for example, it will automatically click in to that battery and can give you up to five to six hours of system upkeep just from that battery without any power at all running to it. The All Secure 650 really is quite superior to any other wireless CCTV systems I've tested. And I think a lot of that is down to the fact that Swan's backstory in this field is CCTVs and camera systems, as opposed to some of the other tech companies that are more generic and just kind of throw a smart home CCTV or home smart system into the ring. The cameras have a power button and an antenna for extended range, which personally I would leave up if given the choice. 
camera lens, spotlight, mic and speakers for two-way communication, a battery slot and threaded section for the mount to go into when installing. Now I must say the installation process is fairly self-explanatory when you follow the instructions uh, from the paperwork provided, but importantly it does seem like you have to have access to a monitor or TV during that setup process with the additional use of that mouse. So even if you don't intend to view your camera recordings and live feeds through a monitor or TV in the long run, you just want to use your phone for that feature, you are still going to need to use those things in order to set up the whole system at the beginning. And I think it would be nice to have a kind of app only smartphone installation and setup as an option. Equally, I do think the added feature of being able to use a kind of desktop monitor experience when viewing footage, etc., is really useful for me. So I didn't really mind that extra step. Now these cameras record in 2K resolution. So live feeds and recorded clips are really nice and sharp and they work all year round as well in various weather conditions with its IP66 water and dust resistant rating. They also work day and night with a 30 meter visibility distance range in black and white in total darkness or 10 meters in full color when the spotlight is activated. As well as the spotlight, you have a siren and the two-way talk capabilities as mentioned, all controllable through the aforementioned Swan security app, available on both iOS and Android. I do feel the app design and navigation could be a little bit more modernized, but I'm definitely more product over aesthetics if I had to choose, and it's certainly crammed with enough features. From left to right, you have your activity data, your playback, which is your recorded clips that have been triggered, your live view, which is pretty self-explanatory, but lets you manually choose which camera you want to check in on in more detail. And you have a mode section and your overall settings. The live view has quite a few extra features from screenshots and microphone activation, etc. Modes lets you customize your system to suit certain use cases like going on holiday or having different settings for nighttime, etc. And in your settings, you can alter things like your individual camera settings sensitivity percentages to reduce false triggers. But the AllSecure 650 also has a really cool feature called True Detect, which can help with this, as it allows motion and the warmth of objects like people and cars to trigger the sensors and push notifications to your devices. Now, as stated by design, this system won't give you quite the reliability of a wired one. It comes with the territory. If your signal between the hub and the cameras is wavering, you may get slightly choppy footage and a few problems. But Swan have included an offline option where you can view it on TV or monitor via the HDMI cable and record without the need for internet. It's also not the most affordable either with differing packages starting from just under 450 pounds. So you will have to weigh up how much those additional features are worth and also how much you'll save in the long term not having to fork out for cloud storage subscriptions. Either way, it's my current CCTV setup here on my property, and with its ease of use and whopping battery life, I can't see myself shifting to another service anytime soon. All the information will be left in the video description below. Go through and check it out in more detail if you're interested. Like the video if you enjoyed it. Subscribe if you're new to the channel and love everything tech. My name's Adam. This is ASBYT. Follow me on my other social medias and also check out some of the other videos that I've done that I think you might enjoy. You've been the best as always. I love you and leave you. I'll see you in the next one. It's ASBYT. Peace out.